So this is the next level, it's the Nissan Bad Dancer truck. I'm going to install uh, two new modded micro servos. These two here, these are a little bit bigger than the ones I use on this side and that side. And those sides control the rear suspension. And I found them to be too weak. And I didn't lift the car as well as I thought it would. So uh, I'm going to replace those uh, smaller servos with the slightly bigger ones. So here you can see the front. And the front setup. You can see it slide up and down. It's uh, it's just a U-bar type of setup. With a micro servo attached in the center. It slides up and down with the U-bar. And if I twist the wheels, you can see that the servo turns. It's a really uh, basic, kind of easy setup, but it works perfect, really smooth. Over here you can see the small micro servo that lifts the front. And uh, now I'm going to try to remove the cabin without causing too much damage. And I need to see the electronics board, that's the mp player with the amplifier. And over here they have the receiver, the 8 channel receiver. Okay, they went rather well, no damage. Here you can see the small connector that connects all the electronics from the cabin to the circuit boards inside the inside the cabin or on the chassis. Micro servos, five in a row. Three of them control the the bed, and the two on the outsides are for the rear suspension. And the small micro servo on the front that I modified, I cut. Some pieces of the housing and I also modified the circuit board adding two resistors so it turns 180 degrees instead of 60 degrees which it normally does and that uh, helps uh, creating more lift on the front. So here's a new micro servo I'm going to use. As you can see it only rotates approximately 90 degrees which is not enough for uh, for the car to lift the, lift the rear suspension so I'm going to modify it using two resistors inside. I'm going to solder two resistors to the circuit board so it will rotate 180 degrees, well almost 180 degrees, which is more than enough to lift uh, the rear suspension. Uh, some micro servos use uh, 2K resistors or 2.4K resistors, but I tried and tested it on these type of servos from Turnigy, and uh, the 1.8K seems to be sufficient. So I'm done uh, adding two SMD resistors, 1.8K in this case, to both sides of the of the prongs. And uh, the prong is uh, belong to the small potentiometer that determines the position of the micro servos arm. Okay, so I installed both new uh, micro servos, two more modified micro servos that rotate almost 180 degrees. The only problem that occurred is that this thing, this part, doesn't fit on the side anymore. So I need to uh, to make the, to extend the wires and put it over here because there seems enough space to fit that part. Well this part is a voltage booster. Uh, it boosts uh, the voltage that is supplied to this car which is 3.7 volt up to 5 volts because um, it proved 3.7 volt proved to be not enough to get this car going in a nice smooth fashion especially the bad dance action was uh, kind of weak using 3.7 volts and this tiny thing over here boost the power to 5 volts which proved to be more than enough to, uh, to get nice action going. 